In this problem, we have to construct a 99% confidence interval for estimating the population mean mu. So whenever you have a confidence interval for the mean, you have to either use Z or T in StatCrunch here, okay? Now, how do you get to StatCrunch? Well, you click on question help and you go to StatCrunch. So if they give you the population standard deviation, you want to use Z. So here it says salaries of 39 college graduates, that's our sample size, who took a statistics course in college have a mean X bar of 66,100. That's the sample mean. Assuming a standard deviation uh, sigma of that right there. So sigma is the population standard deviation. So in this case, we're going to use Z. So population standard deviation Z. So stat, and then we go to Z stats, one sample, and then with summary. Again, it's stat, Z stats, one sample, with summary. We have a summary of the data, so we use with summary. Sample mean, that's going to be 66100. The standard deviation in this problem is 11451. And the sample size is 39, right? That's given here. That's the 39 college graduates. We click on confidence interval. And we have to change it to 99. So it's a 99% confidence interval. Everything looks okay. We click compute. And there's the answers, the lower limit and the upper limit. It says round to the nearest integer. So in this case, it'll be 6, 1, 3, 7, 7. Because I had to round that, that 6 up to a 7. And then 6. Seven zero eight two three. Click check answer, and that's it. I hope that made sense.